Now we just uh, updated our system and we used uh, this, this little icon up here for, to do it. So it's the PAMAC updater, but there's also the package manager. And I sometimes come to it because then I'm looking for an, uh, an application or something like that. I want to know uh, Firefox and I want to know some more informor information about it. So I see I'm at uh, version 53 and so on and so on. Double clicking it gives even more information about dependencies and we can scroll through it or I can take a look and see where all the, all the files are ending up. So it's going to be installed use in mostly in user lib. So the library and there we have a folder and we have a program to run it from user bin Firefox. So this information is quite interesting. I can of course remove and reinstall it as well, but I use it to, to figure out or find stuff like that. And we can um, click it and this, and we also know from which repository it's coming. So this one is coming from the repository of our, our, our system, Arch Labs. There are also groups we can figure out, check, GNOME, i3, states, often foreign, pending, and repositories, repositories itself. So this is our repository. So we have our own packages as well in order to make this ISO for you guys. So there you go. Um, it's interesting to know that it exists because there are also little buttons up here. Refresh database, view history, install local packages, preferences. Also a good thing to check out whether you want to change the preferences. Um, you can refresh mirrors lists and look in the AOR, so the Arch user repository, or clean the cache if you want to. All right, so that's... Um, the complete story, the, 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 the previous tutorial was about the PAMAC updater. So this is the PAMAC manager, which is also quite interesting. Okay.